Okay, we all know that clustering is a fundamental task in unsupervised learning and has many applications. But we also know that it is an ill-posted problem, meaning that the same given data set may be clustered in many different ways. For example, consider three data points, namely an iPhone, an iPhone charger, and a third-party phone charger. How would you cluster them into two groups? While one may separate iPhone products with the rest, the others may put the two chargers into the same group when they are comparing the charger prices. In other words, different people may cluster the same data set in different ways following their own perspectives. The goal of this paper is to uncover the clusters perceived by a particular user using a small amount of side information we get from the user. Most of the previous studies on the same problem regard the side information as the seed or pairwise constraints. These are basically the example clustering results provided the user over the sample data points. However, we found this kind of side information is subject to the sampling bias in practice. That is, the sample data points may be too few to be representative and can actually mislead the final clustering results. In this paper, we propose learning from another kind of side information, called the perception vectors, that capture the reasons behind the seeds or pairwise constraints. We show that these vectors can be easily collected in many applications. For example, an e-commerce website may have already been using the clickstream provided by a user as the pairwise constraints to group products for the user. In this case, we can simply obtain the perception vector as the bag of words of the query string that triggers the clicks. The perception vectors differ from traditional seeds or pairwise constraints in a fundamentally different way. While seeds and constraints are instant level supervision, the perception vectors work as the feature level. We show that the perception vectors complement the instance level supervision and can lead to significantly better clustering results. For more information, please read our paper in chat with us in NIPS 2016.